Hey everyone, so my name is RJ Hakkis. I'm with the Hakkis Art and Custom Framing. And uh, we have the honor of framing this uh, small Little League Baseball jersey. This is from the uh, 2013 um, World Series, you know, Baseball Little League right there. And, um, you know, I don't know if you remember that, actually in Chula Vista, California. So East Lake is part of Chula Vista. And these guys went all the way to the World Series, Little League, and um, unfortunately they lost against Japan. I think it was 6-4. Um, but again, you know, fast forward a few years later, the wife of the coach that uh, coached the Little League uh, actually brought us this jersey for us to custom frame it. I think his birthday is on Sunday, somewhere in there. And uh, so he wants to give it to him uh, for his birthday. And so we're, you know, we're honored to do that. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna put a photo down here as we do with other jerseys. That's a cool little photo of all the, the young, young men right there that play hard. Uh, we're gonna put this metal, <coughs> we're gonna put this metal over on this side. So we're gonna have to do a nice little opening for it there. And then what we're going to do is we're going to put this batch right here of the coach. This is the actual coach, so we're going to put him right there. And, um, and it's going to look real good, so we're going to have to design something really cool uh, for the matting. But I want to show you the placement of the different objects. And when we do jersey framing, we encourage people to bring us photos, you know, patches, medals, I mean, whatever you have you know, we can figure out a way to uh, creatively uh, incorporate them into the design. Let me show you the, the mat, uh, the matting design that we came up with. Okay, so this is the software that we use for the mat design and um, you know, pretty straightforward. This is the big opening. This is where the uh, jersey is gonna go. Uh, this is gonna be a double mat right here. I'm gonna show you the colors that we're gonna be using. The metal is going to go on the left hand side, the coach's badge is going to go on the right hand side, and then this is the photo, so we do a special, you know, kind of um, insertion here along with this so that the whole design just shows up really, really nicely. We're going with the dark green on the outside, this is the matting right here, and then on the inside that little um, accent is going to be yellow. And so we're gonna hit the cut, um, we actually did this. So I'm gonna show you what those mats look like now. Okay, so we went ahead and cut the mat for you, like they do on the cooking channel, right? And we have something cooking in the oven always. And I'm just gonna place it here as best that I can. All right, so we cut the backing. The backing is gonna be white. All right, so this should be the same size by now. And obviously we're gonna do the mounting here um, <clears throat> more professionally. The jersey is gonna to have to go up a little. Just like so. And obviously the metal, you know, it's gonna go in like that. So that's how that metal is gonna go. And then um, batch is gonna go over on this side like so. You know, and, and like I said in the previous videos, a lot of times we'll do something and along the way we say, you know, we don't like the, the background. In this case, we don't think the, the metal and the batch should be on white. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna incorporate some of the leftover pieces. So we actually think that the green background actually looks way better, you tell us move this left like so, so we see the same white there. Nothing is mounted just yet, but I wanna show you sort of a last mock-up here. And, um, and so the whole thing is just looking really, really good. A few more hours, uh, we're gonna start mounting things. Once we get the design right, the color combination right, um, today is Thursday, so customer needs it by Saturday, plenty of time along with some of the other things that we're working on. So we're gonna to get to work on mounting these things permanently 
and then uh, we'll be back and show you. But the little boxes here, you know, the metals and stuff, those will be the hardest because we have to lift the whole thing like so. And so we have to create little boxes around it. So when people look, you know, through it, they're gonna see green, green walls all the way around. That's gonna take us a little bit of time. Uh, but it's fun, right? I mean, we love doing these jerseys. Uh, they tell the story, like in this case, 2013, you know, World Series. And the coach, I believe, is going to be really pleasantly surprised. It's going to bring back good memories about this whole thing. And we're hoping when kids see this, they still have their jerseys. You know, maybe they'll think about custom framing their jerseys as well for the rooms. Uh, you know, so... Let's see what happens. But we'll be back to show you how this whole thing looks once we put it all together. It's done. All right, so let me give you a closer look while it's uh, standing here. Um, I haven't put the glass, but I like to take one final look without the glass to avoid the reflection. Um, and look at the boxes. That just adds some depth to it. The um, you know, jersey looks really good. I like the sort of the design that we chose at the top, kind of around, I call it the Hall of Fame kind of look. The photo there, it really pops as well. And um, you can just kind of see it from every angle there. Looks really cool. The um, It is a little smaller than normal jerseys that we do because of the size of the jersey period. So it ended up about 30 inches by 30 inches, perfect square and uh, looks terrific. So we're gonna put the glass real quick and call the customer and hopefully I can take a picture of her holding it and, uh, and see what she says. But thank you so much for watching. Moving on to the next project. Subscribe, subscribe to the channel. Like this video if you like it. Share it um, and let us know what you think. Uh, and if you have jerseys, you can ship them to us or you can bring them into our uh, San Diego store and uh, I'm gonna put the email, the phone number, uh, so you can uh, get in touch with me. Thank you so much.